I'm gonna have the opportunity to see the tower. Never had the opportunity to do that before. Yeah, just well, us and Facebook. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Between us and my wife, I gotta show off. Look what I did, honey. He's By the way, when you watch that videos of controllers in the 90s, they were a lot funnier looking. Especially <laughs> some of the haircuts. Oh, yeah, I can imagine. That is... I was there in the 90s. Yeah, I kind of figured you might have been. <sighs> I was not. There's this, there's this one... Uh, I was there in the 80s. I was there in the 70s. So, uh... So you didn't get you didn't get fired, huh? Uh, I was in the, I was in the Air Force. All right. Okay. Good. I was I was supposed to get hired, as a matter of fact, because they all got fired. So, uh, are are how many? What what would be the percentage of controllers that are also pilots? I don't know. Ten, now, wow! What a great opportunity. This is something I've never done in all the years that I've been flying. I've never actually taken a tour of the tower and you learn so much more. Your perspective is so much better. First of all, I appreciate the fact that those guys climb up and down those stairs. There's no elevator back there every day, three times a day. And uh, let me just tell you, I'm still breathing. Going, coming down is a lot easier than going up. I was able to talk about taxiing. I was able to talk about really what they're thinking when they're telling me what they want me to do and uh, just a real just a real blessing to be able to do this and you know there's that tower right there uh, MFE what and you know next time I hear these guys I'll even have a clue about who I'm talking to so you know things like uh, where should I do my run up? Um, what should I expect? You know, when I'm departing, what should I expect when I'm uh, entering? Just a lot of those great questions that you always wanted to ask a controller. So, this has really been a great visit.